about prayer? You know, I pray for that things get back to normal or whatever kind of normal there is. I pray that my family is safe. For the neighborhood, for those who wish to stay. I've lived in Utah Beach my whole life, born and raised in the same house, 58 years old. Married 38 years and have two children. We dated when she was 14, I was 15, and um, you know, we just hung out together and stuff like that, and we started dating. And We uh, bought the house from Dad, and Ray fixed it up, constantly changed it. My whole success story is because of her, and when she needed things, I took care of it, and you know, just like I guess I'm doing now. When Sandy arrived, we were just talking about how everything was unfolding and watching the TV and seeing where the surge was coming and where it was going to strike. It took exactly 10 minutes from when there was no water in the street till there was four feet in the street. My wife couldn't walk, she was crying. Anything could have happened, but we just kept moving. It, it looks like a bomb hit it. It looks like you would walk through the streets of, say, Baghdad, total devastation and demolishment. It's just amazing the force of, of, of what nature can do. I'm not going to whether I'm going to rebuild or just take it down and, and, and build new or... I have no electric to take care of the mold and they won't, come to, they won't give me electric until I take care of the mold, so... It's almost a cancer that's growing and I have to demolish it to get rid of it. He changed his house into our home. So I do have sentimentalness here, but not enough to uh, go through this again. Not enough? I didn't tell my kids that yet. <laughs> I, I was born in Manhattan at five years old. We moved to uh, Seafoam Street around the corner from here, and I married my childhood sweetheart, and we've been in this house ever since. So I made two moves in my life. Marianne hasn't made any. Some old pictures. Now these will dry out. Yeah. These, two, these two slides are from our engagement party. Which That was in 1973. Yeah. Mm. That was one of my favorite pictures. I think I could make another move, and I think she will make another move from just the devastation of all that we did in our 38 years of marriage fixing this house up. We just do what we can and uh, move on to the next to the next thing. We're gonna we're gonna make it. We're gonna make it. Um, you know, God's been on my side my whole life. I don't think he's going to leave me now. <laughs> Growing up, we used to hang out right here in front of my house, Raymond and I. We only had to walk around the corner <laughs> to meet each other. Between all our houses, all our kids, uh, you know, it was a big hit for us. But he's holding up strong and has it all together and has a plan and he does it. I try to be focused, but I think going through the day, I'm, I'm not even living it in my mind. I'm just, I'm just functioning. And I know it has to be done and I'm, that's the point I'm trying to drive to. I think by next year we're going to be in a situation where the whole family's going to be settled again. I might have a better idea of what I'm doing with Mary Ann and um, life will go on.